In this opening clip, you're going to watch 2014 graduate Kelsey Mitchell from Cincinnati, Ohio, attends Princeton High School. You see her attack the rim there, arguably the best guard, if not the best player overall in the nation, uh, left-handed, just does a little bit of everything, as you're going to see. I'm going to kind of watch it with you. See her knock down the free throw line jumper there off the scramble. Now she attacks the rim, passes the basketball to Alexa Hart, who finishes that's such a tough look. You get into those gaps. You see her almost in super speed motion. Hop step there on Lanier Coleman and then finish with her right hand. She does so many things really, really well at an elite level. Uh, it makes it really tough to guard or stay in front of her. You see her there with the tricky handle. Looks like she's going to cross it over. Does it. Keeps it in her strong hand. Her ability to make shots from outside of 17 feet off of the left-hand dribble is uncanny. You see her knock another one down there. There'll be another one coming in a minute. She can push the ball with her left hand. She gets back to her right. Once again, there's that vision, and there's Hart to catch it and finish. The defense and that post defender steps over, and Mitchell does as good a job as anybody in the country of reading that second-line, third-line defender, backside defender, and then making the right read from there. You see her once again, that in out. Defender jumps, strong hand three. If you don't play basketball much, that is an extremely, extremely difficult shot opportunity to make. And Mitchell makes it more times than she misses. Uh, you're going to watch her here against the Lady Phoenix in the championship game of our summer invitational. And she just went banana, scored 15 unanswered points in the first half of the game, came back and finished it out clutch. So you're going to see some of that here. Knocking down jumpers. College coaches were just having a blast. You see the back line just full of them. They're watching, being fans. We actually did this on a broadcast when we talked with Mitchell after the game. You see a timeout called there by the Lady Phoenix after another Mitchell shot. That's the shot right there that I was referring to a minute ago when I said you'll see another one out of the corner. The coaches were enjoying the show. I was enjoying the show. Everybody was enjoying the show. Uh, Kyle Moore, our national director of scouting, said Mitchell did the same thing at the AAU event in Orlando in the earlier part of July. She just put so much pressure on you defensively because she's able to get in gaps, stop, and make plays with either hand. Extremely hard to guard. Up in here talking with Kelsey Mitchell, all Ohio, number one player in the 2014 class. Uh, Kelsey, we're sitting in the booth. What a performance there. Yeah, I try. <laughs> I love the humility. 31 points on the night, but maybe more importantly, 14 in the first five and a half minutes and timely shots late. The Lady Phoenix cut it down to four. I know you. You knew they cut it down to four. You come back with two big jumpers in a row. And as Kelsey Rogers Jensen said, that makes you a dagger player, somebody that wants to deaden the run. How does it feel to have the ball late and be able to execute like that? I mean, it feels good, but I know we got to win. We haven't won a championship at all in the summer. So I know it's important to my coach and my teammates that I put my team on my back. Now talk to us a little bit. We're going to defer. We'll come back to this in a minute. But I've got to ask you, all I keep hearing about is Orlando and the Super Showcase. I heard you were absolutely on fire. Did you feel like you were doing anything differently in terms of coming out of the spring and your workouts and just feeling good about your game? I mean, I will say as someone who's seen you play a lot, I feel like your step back and your space creation into your jumper is something that you're doing at a level that you maybe weren't doing last summer. What have you worked on? Though Your father's a high school coach there in Cincinnati. Talk to us about your workouts. I mean, I go hard every day, so it's always something new. Plus, like, my right hand is not where it should be, and I try to work on it every day. So every day is like, I know I got to go hard. I love it. Now, what's one thing that you obviously your right hand, give us a drill or give us like a five minute span inside of your workouts with you and, and your dad at Taft High School in Cincinnati. They got air conditioning in the gym. Huh? Is there air in the gym in there? Nah. No air. So we'll talk to us about, we'll call it the hot box then. Talk to us about a workout with you and your dad in the hot box. Your sister Chelsea, y'all in there sweating the boys. Give us kind of a run through of what you've been working on. I mean, you, two hands, they slapping you. Make sure you don't lose the ball. I mean, you got to go hard. They throw it off the rim, right hand, left hand. I mean, basically, it's, it's everything that we do in the gym. 
it going to happen in the game. So I'm, I'm willing to work on everything. So talk to us. That's awesome. Coming back to this tournament, last night y'all were playing A-Game Canada, a trip to the finals. Today's finals on the line. You step up to the plate huge, 50-48 late. You get fouled under 10 seconds. You go to the free throw line and you ice them. What are you thinking when you go to the free throw line there? Put them in. <laughs> Put them in. Is there a routine? Is there a one, two, three, set, shoot? Do you shoot the same way every time? What do you like to do? I, I, shoot, the way, I shoot the same way every time. I roll the ball. I just take a breath because you already know I'm tired. <laughs> That's it, though. I love it. Well, once again, thanks for coming on with us. Magnificent performance. We call them signature performances. Maybe the best signature performance I've seen all summer. You know how much basketball I watch. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, tuning in for Brandon Clay and Kelsey Mitchell. Thanks for joining us. Kelsey, thanks for your time. Thanks for having me. Any gym is home.